Hi, Caesar here with smartblogging.net. What I have in front of me right now is the Flexibility 3 theme. And um, what I want to do is show you how to edit the text that's right here, right below the header. And um, basically all you do is you log into your WP admin, to your administration area in your WordPress blog. And um, normally these settings uh, on some themes, they are right within the actual theme itself. Um, you would think that they have it available within the flexibility theme options, right? Uh, I looked through all these tabs and I couldn't find it anywhere. So that's when, when that happens, it's usually because it's in the code somewhere. So what I want to do now is show you, because I did find it and it's, it's hidden within the code in, in one of the pages, uh, code pages. So here we go. Let me show you where to go so you can edit that if, if you wanted to keep that particular design the way it looks on the sample site. Just click over here where it says editor under appearance and it'll bring you to this page here and here you have a, a list of all the files that make up that theme. So what you're going to do is this is the page that you land on when you click on that editor link. So what you're going to do is scroll that all the way down to where it says feature feature.php is the file that actually holds the code for that particular area within the page. So here we go. Um, okay, so this title here where it says Flex Squeeze Theme is right there. So you can just change that and you can call this title on the right. Then you can change the copy get the ultimate theme for building WordPress niche sites. Okay, that's right over here. Okay. Okay, and then you can also change this link to go anywhere you want. So I'm going to change this to, I'll keep the www, actually I don't need that. I'll just have it go directly to my blog. Okay. Uh, read more, you can change that also. Right now it's, uh, it's bolded. Anytime you see anything with strong, it means that it's bolded. And you can change that to, you know, you can change the read more to click here. Okay, and that's it on the right. Now we can change the one on the left by doing the same. So the one on the left says pop quiz, which company is recommended? <laughs> okay, it's, it's a little funny the way it, the code broke it up, but this is where you would change the pop quiz text. This is the title on the left. Okay, and right below that, it says, which company is recommended? Well, that's also up here. Which company is recommended by WordPress is the best host for bloggers. Okay, so change the text. Okay, that's that. Then we need to find the list, right? So we want to link to, um, we want to we want to have these linked to wherever we want them to go. So we would now we need to look for those. So we can do this. We can. They're all here. I was going to say we can search for it in the Finder, but uh, we don't have to because I can see that they're all here. So you would put this is the link of where. Whoops. This is the link of where you want the link to go. So. I can put on here, you know, if I want people to click on, uh, want them to go to my YouTube channel, they'll go there. And put on here, YouTube. If I wanted them to, now on the second one, I can have them go. I want them to go to Facebook, then I would label this Facebook. 
So ba basically the one on this here on the right is basically the label for this link. Okay? And that gives you an idea of what you what you could do. Um if you don't have if you if all you have is two links, you can just go you can actually just delete these and you'll only right that's all you do for that and if there's anything else the answer my the answer may shock you let's look for that um, the answer here it is Once you've done those changes, then all you do is click update file. Go to the front end and look at it. Hit refresh, and voila, made the changes. Okay, so yeah, so that's basically where it is. It's in the feature.php file right over here. Okay, that's it. Hope you like this video. If you have any questions, give me a call. Um, or leave a comment below. More than happy to help you out. Take care. Bye.